All right. Hello, everyone. So now we have in the series of rankers and poppers in NEET PG 2023, we have Dr. Rajesh Gowda, who has scored rank 81 All India in NEET PG uh, entrance exam. And uh, he's a student from Mysore Medical College. And um, the most interesting part that I want to share before we begin is that he's a student of TAMS Ultimate Live App course, which is one of its kind in the whole country where there are no pre-recorded videos. It's a online course where you know you attend the lecture live and you solve your queries in a chat box in a two-way system so first of all dr rajesh congratulations to you and how are you feeling right now thank you so much sir i'm feeling happy and i'm very grateful for my parents god and to all my teachers who helped me in this journey it was not so very easy to go through this phase and i used to watch your motivational videos so sir motivational videos whenever i used to feel very low so, yeah, yeah, you were saying something. And apart from reading, I used to get so many negative thoughts. Will I be able to do it or not? Then at such times, I used to watch your motivational videos and Sumesh sir motivational videos. And I used to get back to my routine again. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. So how did this, this journey start, Dr. Rajesh? Like... Uh, Mysore Medical College, you entered and how, you know, when was that moment when you decided that, you know, I have to prepare and how did this all start? Please tell us about your journey. I actually started preparing in the internship, not for the sake of need. PJ started just reading text, textbooks. I started reading surgery, I read Bailey and Love in internship, not for the sake to clear need PG. So I read surgery, OBG, and around five to six subjects I finished in internship, sir. Then actually I started preparing seriously for uh, NEET PG after my internship. So uh, in INI, I got a rank of around 500. Then like I followed uh, your DVT so much. It's like every word I gave importance in DVT. And I made it my 20th book before exam, before three days before exam, I read the DVT of all the subjects and I added whatever extra points were needed. I added in the DVT and made it my 20th notebooks. Okay. Amazing. Amazing. So in this journey, I mean, whenever you felt low or you felt a little negative, you said that, you know, uh, of course uh, you saw the videos and everything, but what do you think that, you know, this is an exam which is doable. Like, is this, uh, I mean, is this exam that difficult as it is assumed to be? Initially, I thought it was difficult before preparation and during preparation, I thought it will be difficult. Once I gave an in internship, I just gave NEET, PG without actual preparation. Then I got to know that NEET is actually easy, but the, the many people made it think so difficult, but it is actually kind of easy and it is very doable. And I'll tell you, I never got distinction in any of my um, undergrad uh, classes. So it is actually doable. It's very much doable, sir. Okay, so we'll continue from here itself. So I'm asking you that when did you execute your first plan? Like what, what was the time when you decided that, you know, this is, I have to do it and this is my plan? After one month of my internship, I was uh, decided that whatever I should, like I'm even now, I do not know what brand should I take. So at that point, I decided my rank should be like that. I should get whatever branch at the end of the counseling. I wish I should, I could get it. Okay. okay. So how was, how dams played a role and how did you come to know about the ultimate live app and how did you take benefit uh, from it? I, Please, if you can tell uh, us. In dams, many of my friends joined in second year and third year. Sir. So it was very popular in Mysore because we have a center here. Yeah. So most of my friends joined in second year and third year. I, after internship, I decided to take uh, DAMS. So I watched psychiatry. It was so good. It was like just a relaxation session more than an educational thing. Sir used to teach so well, so conceptually and used to enact all the words. It was very good yes. psychiatry. Yes. Dr. Sachin is known for it. <laughs> so and then yeah. how, how, did it, how did it go further? Uh, and uh, radiology and internship PGs used to ask, like what CT, MRI and everything. I was like, everything looks black and white. How will I tell? But after watching Sumer sir's video, now I can even depict and tell MRI types, everything. It, it taught so well. Even diseases, normal, everything he taught so well, sir. 
So, I mean, uh, you were quite okay with the with the live teaching on the app. I mean, uh, you found it convenient, quite convenient. Yeah, sir. I never attended live classes, so I I found it very convenient to sit at a place and uh, I was a person who can concentrate for a long hours. Okay. So I I used to sit at a place and I used to text if I had any doubts and the teachers used to reply. So that way we got connected. I feel. Okay, okay. Any other dams uh, resource that you feel is you know uh, is is good for you? Uh, Pune Ma'am's biochem. I I initially I had a thought that biochem is such a not so good subject, but after watching Pune Ma'am's class, I felt like okay, it is related to everything in MBBS, but we are not giving importance what it should be. Then I got to know biochem is such a good subject, and even now I remember your TB. Uh, classes of ortho so well i think i remember for a long time just because you explained so well conceptually and with images and i followed you so you much yeah 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 and notes are the gold standard so any piece of advice dr rajesh to your uh, juniors to your uh, you know people who are looking up to you right now i would say uh, do the notes properly PYQs and last one week, whatever is possible. Like I, I was not able to read for last two days or three days sir, before exam because I was a bit anxious and nothing was going into my head. I had a thought that I forgot everything. So I watched a few motivational videos and they said it is normal. Every everyone will be feeling same at this time. So I whether I read or not, but I tried to remain calm at that phase. And yeah, I think it went well, sir. of course it went well you scored right 81 that's not a joke and everybody who is watching us right now will now understand that even a person who has scored 81 rank uh, could not study in last 3 days because of anxiety so this is normal this is physiological it is okay to feel um, like that so uh, of course you have mentioned it earlier but still i'm you know i'm going to ask you any uh, branch that you think that you have have in your mind right now with this rank <laughs> Present. I have three branches: medicine, surgery, and radio, which are completely unrelated. So, don't worry. We will 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 solve that query for you very soon in the mentorship session. We'll do a career okay. counseling where uh, we'll talk about that. So, Dr. Rajesh, uh, amazing rank and amazing efforts, and convey my you know gratitude and regards to everyone in your family as well. And I congratulate you once again. Thank you so much. Thank Wish you, you the best. Oh, one uh, one yeah, of my you. students told to say hi to you because she is such a huge fan. She is third year PG now. and she attended your live class in kerala she okay. still follows you she told don't forget to say my hi okay what's her name christine sir christine so say my hi to dr christine as well and uh, hopefully you know i will see you guys very soon as and when you know i'm there and uh, definitely will be in touch So thank you so much to you to Dr Christine and everyone for this uh, humbling affection and I wish you all the best and I can tell you one thing for sure that you know any branch that you take further you are definitely going to make everyone around you proud of you thank you so much Dr Rajesh thank you so much wish you the best